as I mentioned earlier, YouTube is doing their Proud to Love campaign right now, and people are putting up videos using hashtag Proud to Love about who they love, why they love, what they love, and that is exactly the question that I'm going to pose to all of you in order. I have a sense we know what you love, Johnny, well, but bring it anyway. I mean, I would like to first say that I'm proud to love all of America's tight, young, muscular gentlemen, <laughs> lumberjacks, military men, truck drivers, tall man, shorter man, man with a big thigh, man with a juicy booty, man with a thong, strong forearm. Johnny, one, one, one minute for oh, answer. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you have me a glass of water, please. <laughs> um, but also, I want to tell you, I'm proud to love the gay family that we create for ourselves. That's something pretty magical that gay people have been able to do, surround yourself with your family. So uh, I'm proud to love all my gay family. I'll see you out there, boo-boo, love you, baby. <laughs> Hannah, who or what or how or why do you, this is like current events. In yeah, no, grade. I really like it. Yeah. Um, I'm proud to love, you know, this is probably not as good for me as it is, but I really, really love cheese. And I <laughs> just, every day I think about it, it's the first thing I think about when I wake up. Um, no, but uh, in all seriousness, uh, and I have to say this just because my community is so good to me, I love my online community. I love the group of heartosexuals that are out there wanting to do good together and impact the world in a positive, open-minded way. Yeah, I yeah. do love cheese, too. Right, but yeah. cheese, you know, ultimately, I, I, am I, I right? I, I, I cheese lovers a bad name. <laughs> <laughs> have you guys noticed that gay guys usually don't eat cheese in front of each other? I feel like lesbians are willing to eat cheese. <laughs> this is the first time I've heard of it. You've never? Where are you hanging out? Yeah. Gay guys don't eat bread in front of each other. You eat bread in front of each other. And, and eat cheese pasta. in front of your boyfriend. I know. Yeah. I've been spending too much time in West Hollywood. And Miss Whitney Mixter, who or what or why are you proud to love? Well, I must say I agree with you. I am also proud to love cheese as well. Um, mm. But I'm proud to love my wife. And I'm also proud at the fact that I can get married again for the third time. It's a charm. <laughs> yeah. uh, but now legally in this beautiful state of California. Um, You've been living as an outlaw. I have, God, it feels so Living good. Living in sin. That's yeah. right. Um, but I'm also proud that we are re-examining kind of our mentality on marriage and love and what it, what it means in this country. And um, I'm proud uh, that there are still people out there like Wendy Davis who is willing to stand for 13 hours straight without oh, king, with a back brace for something that she believes passionately about. Yeah. So. And it all worked out because they tried to sneak it in and make it not work. Amazing. The 11th but it all hour. worked out. She did it. Alec Mappa, who? She did it. Or why or what? <laughs> what are you proud of? Yeah. Uh, I'm proud to love my husband, proud to love my son. That's a whole kind of thing that I didn't imagine was possible when I was a kid. Uh, so the fact that I'm living that dream is exciting to me every day. I am proud to be part of this radical minority because it's always the radical minority in America that pushes this country forward. It's never the majority that wakes up one morning and goes, hey, you know what, let's free the slaves. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you know what, let's let women vote. That's a good idea. It's always a radical minority, it always starts off as a small voice that knows what's true and knows what's just, and I'm really proud to be a part of this moment. Yeah. Well yeah. said, well said. <laughs> All right, Bree, you got an applause break. Who are okay. you proud to love or why? Or uh, what? I am proud to love my parents mm -hmm. because they are the most amazing human beings and I was so scared to admit this part of myself to them and the way they handled it, I am just so proud to be their daughter because my, my dad, we went on a walk and he brought it up out of nowhere and he looked at me and he was like, I was about to tell him, and he was like, you don't have to say anything. And he just hugged me, and he's like, I just want you to be happy. It doesn't matter who with. And I was like, OK, I'm the luckiest girl in the entire world. Aww. Applause for the dad right there. Tear break. Yeah. A little single tear break. A little tear. Right. Let's hunt your dad. All right, well, I guess I have to answer this myself. <laughs> I, I would say I'm prouder more than anything else about timing right now. We are in something that is so cool. The fact that you guys, whether you're gay or straight or bi or trans or give me another one, robot. Queer questioning. Yeah. Queer questioning, there's a lot of letters. The <laughs> fact that it's actually, it's become cool that this thing that like I feared my whole life that I think most of us did that we thought was something broken in us is actually cool now and I'm with my straight friends. Like they actually think it's cool that I'm gay. And uh, it's uh, and the sex also.